Hopefully by now you're feeling relatively confident using the play command to ask Sonic Pi to use one of its inbuilt synthesizers to generate us a note at a certain pitch. So here I've written play colon C4 and when I run that I get a beautiful note of middle C played by the beep synthesizer that comes with Sonic Pi. But there is another way that we can add sounds to our programs and that is by adding little bits of recorded audio into the mix as well. And we can do that by using this thing called the sample command. And when I type in sample to Sonic Pi, you'll notice that I get this big long list of options that come after sample. And these are all of the pre-recorded samples that come as standard with this software. So you don't have to go out and record a load of stuff or sample anything to start working with the samples. You get them automatically when you install the software. So by writing sample colon loop amen full in this case, that's telling us that we want to make use of this thing that Sonic Pi knows about called loop amen full, which is a sample, a bit of recorded music. So when I run that, you'll hear that we get the Amen break, which if you know anything about hip hop music, you'll know it's a really good sample to include if we want to create a funky, jazzy, hip hop kind of composition. There's actually a way of including any piece of recorded audio in your Sonic Pi program, and I will show you that in due course. But for now, I'd recommend taking 10 minutes or so to explore the samples that come with the software. We can get those by just typing sample and then a colon, and then we'll see a nice long list of things that we can play around with. So I'm gonna try combining the sample of Ambi Piano with Ambi Drone and and something else, let's say Ambi Choir and see what that sounds like. Okay, interesting sound. So have a go at that and I'll see you in the next video.